an incredible journey to learn more about my path that I recently got the opportunity to trace. I got a chance to trace my family tree way back and then hundreds of years back in a new episode of Finding Your Roots that airs tonight. And even I was shocked by some of the revol results. Check it out. It's the show that helps us trace our ancestry. And now it's my turn to this, find this my really roots. Just over 150 years ago, my family made history in Texas. Shankleville community named for Jim and Winnie Shankel, known as first Newton County blacks to buy land to become local leaders after gaining freedom by emancipation. Almost overnight, they went from being a slave to a landowner. That's amazing. And when we trace my lineage even further back, Royalty, I'm a king, y'all. <laughs> Charlemagne is your 39th great grandfather. What? <laughs> and I come from, okay, this, the king of England, and, but also a king in their own rights, the Shankles. Oh, the Shankles. In Texas. Yes. Came from nothing to create something. A great family tree. Oh, thank you. It, it is great to have Dr. Henry Lewis Gates, Jr. from Finding Your Roots here with me this morning. And you, you took me on one heck of a journey, and, and I've always wondered, how does this start? You know, how do you begin a search like this? Well, we have a fabulous team, a chief genealogist named Johnny Cerny, and a genetic genealogist named Cece Moore. And they, their work came to bear on finding your English ancestry, and I'll tell you how. We found a woman, your great-great-grandmother, named Harriet Mead, listed in the census, with eight children but a widow. But when we looked at your DNA, it was all tracking to a family named mm -hmm. Bishop. We went back to the paper trail, and guess what? Guess who was living next door? A white man named William Bishop. Mm, somebody it, was creeping. Yep, okay. and they had, they had sneaking and creeping, we call it. <laughs> and they had four children together. And when we traced your ancestry back through, through your bishop line, through your great-great-grandfather, we found your 11th great-grandparents got married in 1600. Shakespeare was alive. And in 1630, they then moved to the Massachusetts Bay Colony. And then through them, you descend from King John of Runnymede with the Magna Carta. Um, we found your 44th great-grandfather, who was Arnulf, the Bishop of Metz. And they, they're your people. Well, I'll be honest with you, I wasn't surprised by my royal roots. Um, but, <laughs> but I can imagine, though, when you do this for people, some people might find some really surprising things. What are some of the things that you found that have surprised you, even? Well, the, uh, one of the most surprising things was uh, LL Cool J's story. Mm -hmm. And um, LL Cool J, of course, is Todd Smith. Mm -hmm. He's very close family, very close to his grandparents. But it turned out, we found out, that his mother unbeknownst to her, had been adopted in 1947. Oh, wow. And we have a protocol, you know, we can't reveal certain things live because it's quite traumatic. And I had to call him to say, Todd, you know, your mother was adopted. Mm -hmm. And he goes, what are you talking about? You know, I'm close to my grandparents. And I said, they are not her biological parents. And he said, what am I supposed to do? I said, well, call your mother. And she had suspected it. Oh, she wow. had suspected it. Would and I'm just curious, do you feel like a detec detective when you do this type of work? I feel like um, I've been blessed. I feel like each of us has an ancestor on our family tree waiting to tell a story. And my job is to open the window so they can um, poke their head out and tell you all about themselves, which is telling you about yourself. Well, I tell you what, you definitely did that for me and, and, and you opened up a window that I never knew. And I thought I knew about my family history until I met with you and a lot of things even surprised my parents who I shared all of this with. And I, I really appreciate this. And this is amazing. If you haven't done it, make sure you do. Dr. Henry Lewis Gates, thank you so much. And you can see Finding Your Roots tonight on PBS. Make sure you check it out. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.